Okay, so we now have a socially awkward genius in a room full of attractive, age-appropriate women. All he has to do now is hook up with one of them. <laughs> Anyone else see the flaw in this plan? <laughs> Okay, we cannot leave this to chance. Let's pick a girl and figure out how to get her together with Dennis. Okay. How about that one? Uh-uh. I know the type. Cheerleader, student council, goes out with the jocks, won't even look at anybody in the gifted program. And if, after two years of begging, she does agree to go out with you, it turns out to be a setup, and you're in the back seat of your mom's car with your pants off while the whole football team laughs at you. Are you crying? No, I have allergies. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, hey, how about her? Sure. If he wants to spend a couple years doing her homework while she drinks herself into a stupor with non-fat white Russians, and you're the one holding her head out of the toilet while she's puking and telling you she wishes more guys were like you. And then she gets into Cornell because you wrote her essay for her and you drive up to visit her one weekend and she acts like she doesn't even know you. Okay, so not her either. Could I have everyone's attention, please? What a wonderful occasion this is. And how fortunate that it should happen to fall on Take Your Daughter to Work Day. <laughs> We're here to welcome Mr. Dennis Kim to our little family. Welcome, Dennis Kim. <laughs> Mr. Kim was not only the valedictorian at Stanford University, he is also the youngest recipient of the prestigious Stevenson Award. Youngest till the cyborgs rise up. <laughs> And now, without any further ado, let me introduce the man of the hour, Mr. Dennis Kim. Dennis? Dennis? What? Would you like to tell us a little bit about your upcoming research? Uh, no, thanks. I'm going to the mall with Emma. <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, the kid got a girl. Unbelievable. Did anyone see how he did it? Unbelievable. Components I built are on the International Space Station, and I get a ticket for launching a model rocket in the park. I don't know if the ticket was so much for the launch as it was for you telling the policewoman, you have to frisk me, I have another rocket in my pants. Hey, look at that. It's Dennis Kim. Wow, I almost didn't recognize him. You know, I kind of feel bad about what we did to him. Yeah, we really ruined his life. Screw him, he was weak. <laughs> <laughs> 